SRE takes people from a systems engineering background and people from a software engineering background and combines them on teams to work together. So if something goes down, like say the website goes down, SREs along with the devs are working actively to make sure that everything stays up, everything's running smoothly. They work on resilience, on scalability, uh, on performance, on observability and incident response capabilities for those products. So essentially what you're doing is making sure the well-oiled machine continues to be well-oiled. I really like having that mix of the more tactical system administration side and then being able to work on like actual scale projects. But then it's cool having this really wide company level view of like the infrastructure and how it all ties together. SREs are embedded with product teams. They are sitting uh, next to software engineers, product managers, data scientists, QA, program managers, and working collaboratively, uh, that, that, that cross-functional group owns the product and you know iterates on it together. For an SRE, yes, I have projects since I'm a rotator, but some days I would come in and my mentor would be like, hey, Megan, there's something happening. We need all hands on deck. So essentially coming in the work and not knowing what to expect, if there's going to be a problem or if there's some puzzle that maybe only you know the answer to, it's kind of exciting. It's a great team. You know, all the people that we have are really smart, really talented. I like working with everyone on the team. We solve actual interesting problems. But everyone has different backgrounds, so we're always teaching each other new things. Or if I have a question, I just like shoot it out into the Slack chat and be like, hey, I don't understand what this is. Can anyone help? And they're just like, oh yeah, come to my desk. People that are interested in attacking really hard problems, that tends to be a, a type that's drawn to SRE. Having a strong programming or a strong system administration background helps. A lot of what we do is troubleshooting. If you really like looking into architecture and trying to find problems that may not be apparent now, but down the line may be catastrophic, then you should work as an SRE.